In this tutorial, we're going to teach you how you can upload a property to your websites once you've enabled the portals in the engine section. In the properties database, you'll want to find the property that you want to upload by either using your listed filter or by searching for the property address. Go into your property and once you have set this up as a listing with all of the photos and the marketing in the details section and also in your images, you'll then be able to go to the portals tab. Now in your portals tab, this is where you'll control what will be uploaded. So you can see that we can choose to display our price or have it left turned off and this will display as contact agent. For this listing, we'll display the price. We can also choose to display the address. If you leave this off, it will display as no address and only the suburb online. When the property sells, you can choose to display your sold price. The advertised status will determine how the property is uploaded. So for current, it means it's available. If it's a rental, it will then be able to be marked as leased, which means it is now being leased. If it's an advertised property for sale, you can pull it off the market by using the off the market option. And if you sell the property, you can upload it as sold. For now, we're gonna upload it as current and then hit update settings to save this. Once this is saved, you can then activate the portals you want to send this property to. So we have domain and realestate.com.au here as inactive. I wanna choose for it to go to domain, and then I wanna choose for it to go to realestate.com. Once both of the portals are marked as active, and I have all of my settings set up, I can then hit the upload property option. This has now sent this property live as a new listing with the price displaying, address displaying, through to domain.com and realestate.com.au.